Hello guys, um, I'm going to show you a quick tutorial on how to recover data on a, a BitLock encrypted hard drive that's failing to mount on Windows. So recently I got a friend of mine who had uh, a hard drive that was an external hard drive that had a BitLocker on it. So on entering the, the, the password, the hard drive would then cause the machine to crash uh, with a blue screen of death. So we've tried solutions with um, Windows 7, Windows 8, and Windows 8.1 and Windows 10. So all those three tested platforms were all failing. So this is a quick tutorial on how to recover the data. First of all, you need to open uh, your terminal. I'm using uh, Kali Linux, by the way. Um, I'm using Kali Linux, as you can see. So um first of all you need to be root just enter my password okay then you need to um install a software called uh dislocker so for me uh, i have already installed the software Oops. Okay, so I've already installed this lock as you can see. So um, the first stage is to plug in the the hard drive that's failing and use the command d message d message to check if the drive is being detected. As you can see, the drive is now being detected as SDB one. So I'll just okay i'll just show you quickly departed okay this is the address that i want to 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 access <coughs> so it says big lock as you can see so i'll use the the command this locker dash r for read only dash v um, the device which is device sdp1 then the passphrase I had already copied the recovery passphrase phrase then the intended mount point okay so this f mount is uh, a mount point that I've uh, created myself in my uh, machine just to show you quickly, I've got three mod points. Um, not three mod points, I've got multiple mod points that I've created. So, for example, you can see it, I have this one called Happy, uh, this one's called Nest Nestos, and this one called um, F Mount. So, if I sit into the change my directory into the F Mount directory, you can see now it has created uh, a dislocker file. So this is now the uh, hard drive, the BitLocker um, drive with the key now put in. So um, now I need to mount this DisLocker file into another mount point. So I just want to show you something. So as you can see in this uh, mount point code here, there's nothing. So I'm going to mount media happy as you can see let's just check to see if it has mounted uh, as you can see now the drive has been mounted in happy so you can now use Nautilus to open the directory so this is the external hard drive that was failing to mount that's now mounted so now I can access uh, the data that I want 
and recover the stuff that I want. So unfortunately for me, uh, the drive won't want in read write mode. So I can only copy the data in it and um, format that drive, uh, format that drive, and maybe do whatever I want to do with that drive. So yeah, thank you for watching, guys. That was a short tutorial. If you have any questions, leave in the comment sections, and I will be able to answer. Thank you.